Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy, and today's quick tip is an Adobe After Effects CC 2021. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the corner pin effect so you can transform videos or animations onto a still image and have them fit in the space that you want without distorting the video or animation. So first, we'll add the video to the iMac screen. I'm going to select it over here in the project panel and just drag it right onto this composition. Next, I'm going to pre-compose this layer. Pre-composing will just make it easy if you ever want to swap out or replace the image or video without having to redo the effect every time. To pre-compose, I'm going to right click or control click right on the layer and select pre-compose. Select move all attributes into the new composition, give it a new composition name if you want, and then click OK. Select that new video pre-comp Come up to the Effects and Presets. If you don't see that, go to Window, Effects and Presets, and do a search for Corner Pin. There's Corner Pin under the Distort section. Just click on it and drag it right onto that video pre-comp. In the corners, you will see these big circles. That is what we're going to use to transform this video or pre-comp layer. So I'm just going to click on one of those and just start moving them into position. You can get a rough placement here, then you want to zoom in and just make sure that you're getting everything. I use the space bar to move around. You'll see as soon as I use my space bar, the cursor turns into a hand. I'm just going to drag these into position. Drag the playhead at the beginning, hit the space bar. Easy as that. If you ever lose the circles in the corners and you're trying to make adjustments, you have the video selected but you still don't see them, all you have to do to get those circles back at any time is just click on the word corner pin in the effect controls. When you click on that, they should reappear and then you can make some adjustments. Now let's add a video to this iPhone. I'm going to select this vertical video that I made for Instagram stories. And instead of creating a pre-comp this time, what I'm going to do is take this video and drag it right onto this new composition button. That's just going to create a new composition, the exact dimensions of this video. So whenever I want to swap out another vertical video, it'll be the same dimensions. I'll drag that vertical composition right onto the main composition. It's a little big, so I'm just going to tap S to scale it down so I can see what I'm doing. I'm going to go up to the effects and presets. Do a search for corner pin. Once you find it, I'm just going to drag it right onto that video. You'll see those circles in the corners, and now I'm just going to drag it into position. The cool thing about this effect is that you're not going to distort the video. So let's get it roughly in place. I'll zoom in here and just line it up to the corners of this iPhone screen. Using the space bar to go into the hand tool. I'll drag the playhead back to the beginning. I'll hit the space bar to preview. And now we have both videos playing lined up perfectly thanks to the corner pin. If you ever want to swap out or replace one of your pre-comps or composition, just double click on it. Replace it with another video or photo. When you go back to your main composition, it will update automatically and you're good to go. That is how you use the corner pin in Adobe After Effects. My name is Mike Murphy. Cheers.